Hello guys, welcome to Deepak Pari Clips. Thank you for clicking on this video. This is one particular clip from the main episode, the link to which is in the description. Please click on it to watch the full video. And meanwhile, you're here. Enjoy this clip. You you mentioned uh, about one of the cases being, um, you know, dysfunctional parents or uh, relationships going here and there or a lot of things, failed marriages, or divorces, a lot of things. Um, I want to talk quickly talk about one angle before we move on to tarot. Yeah. Um, what is why are marriages becoming so difficult in today's time and age? Because we don't have the patience. We are always ready that if this marriage doesn't work, I can get out of it. We feel entitled that our partner should be able to be the perfect fit for us, and we are perfect anyways. So we don't have to change anything within ourselves. Um, and just because I'm a high earning person, why do I need to contribute to the house or why do I need to take care of home responsibilities or no, parenting should be done like this only, like that. We're too rigid. We are too rigid in our ways and in our opinions. If you are a blood and you have to live a blood and you have to live a blood, then it will never be a blood. You have to lose your identity first. To be able to blend and then say, chal yaar, dono hi kheer ban jate That is needed in a marriage. But that rigidity is not allowing people to blend. If we can just lose the fear, okay, agar main kaviyal, sedani, jo hoon, agar wo sedani ka identity chala gaya, to fir, why should I let it go, bhai? I have created, I've worked so hard on creating this surname. Why should, it's not just about the surname, it's your willingness. The willingness is missing. People have become increasingly selfish and impatient. And unfortunately, there is too much variety. There is too much available. There is too much attention very easily available everywhere. Paradox of plenty. Yes. People are spending 12, 12, 14, 14 hours at their corporate homes and they have corporate spouses now. Okay, in office mein mera spouse hai. ये ऑफिस साइड मेरे ऑफ काम के साइड को पहचानता है ये मेरे घर वाला स्पाउस है ये मेरे घर के साइड को पहचानता है ऐसे नहीं होता इट इज गोइंग टू प्रिक यू एंड मैरिज इज स्पिरिचुअली योर पार्टनर इज अ मिरर टू योर डीपेस्ट डार्केस्ट सेल्फ सो व्हेन अ पार्टनर कम्स इन टू योर लाइफ यू विल सडनली ऑल योर डीप डार्क parts of you will pop up and then you'll be like bloody hell now I'm getting angry I'm getting envious I'm getting jealous I'm getting possessive it's all because of you I was never like this ask any of my other people I was never like this I was the most chill person boss you are always like this you just didn't know it now that this partner has come into your life they are holding a mirror to your subconscious so that you can see these things and you can use it as an opportunity to heal it. But what do we do? I don't like you because you make me feel this way. So I will break the mirror and I will choose another mirror. What? Be my guest. The other mirror also in the next couple of years will start showing you the same things. That's how we repeat patterns. When we don't solve something that has come to the surface, we leave it, we abandon it, mm. we choose something else, we repeat the same pattern. Interesting. So, um, what constitutes a happy, successful marriage or is it still a myth? No, no, no. There is this, the formula is very simple. Completely understanding and accepting that this partner that has come into my life has come for me growing emotionally, mentally, physically, spiritually, financially, in every which way. But this growth will not happen on my conditions. My financial growth could happen simply because my husband's businesses failed. Hmm. Because if his businesses were doing well, I would be a lazy, rich housewife just going to kitty parties. But if I start getting angry, what the hell? How can your businesses fail? That was one condition. I saw that you were rich and that's why I married you and now you're a kangal and now I hate you. But that work has been lost, that's why you're here. So you actually got to honor the sacrifice that soul has made so that you could grow. We grow through pain. Deepak, we are a species that grow through pain and threat. 
अगर हमारी लाइफ पूरी कंफर्टेबल हो गई ना तो हम लोग सिर्फ नेटफ्लिक्स और चिल्ली करेंगे जिंदगी भर किसी को कुछ करने की जरूरत ही नहीं रहेगी सोल वर्ल्ड में ऐसा ही है इन द सोल वर्ल्ड एवरीथिंग इज परफेक्ट परफेक्ट यू वांट अ हाउस क्लोज योर आईज इमेजिन इट्स राइट देर बट वाई डू वी टेक बर्थ ऑन द ह्यूमन रेल्म सो दैट वी कैन फॉल एंड लर्न एंड पॉलिश आवर सेल्स एंड एक्सपीरियंस दिस होल डायनामिक एंड ओन इट सो दैट बिकम्स लाइफ लॉन्ग लर्निंग अदरवाइज दर इज नो वैल्यू ऑफ दैट लर्निंग Sometimes if you want to emotionally grow you want to experience absolute freedom bhai freedom to tabhi hi mehsoos hogi jab aap pehle kahin pe jakde hue paaye jao to aapka partner agar aapko jakad ke rakhta hai possessive hai aapko chutti nahi de raha hai tab aap jab us situation se ladoge tab freedom experience karoge na to be understood that is only possible in a premise of misunderstanding Mm. of course when there is a contrary you understand that, the that meaning is, of that is why we take birth on the earth realm because the earth realm provides us the contradiction because there is darkness we experience light because there is poverty we experience richness because there is insensitivity we experience sensitivity so you got to see that my partner could teach me these things in a multitude of ways Hmm. but not like oh you only teach me through comfort nobody learns through comfort nobody when you can own that that my partner is doing his best or her best and i got to do my best and i got to be patient and i got to give gratitude for the small things my partner has also got me in his life because he wants someone who can truly see and appreciate and value who he is without him being perfect when we can do that for our partner's life is so much more beautiful so it's just mirroring your partner mirror your partner and accept the raw sides of them accept the imperfect sides of them because that's who you are as well you are raw you are imperfect mm. and like i said if you're seeing imperfection in your partner you can only see it because you have it within yourself to agar ye myth hai ki nahi main perfect hu main to roop ki rani hu bhaiya chhod do usko side pe koi perfect nahi hai Hello guys thank you so much for watching the video if you liked it please like share subscribe share it around on your whatsapp on your instagram tinder bumble every single where because we need that traction but thank you so much for watching the video and you will come across every new clip every single day so don't forget to subscribe and i'll see you guys around thank you cheers